Caliphate is the title of rulership in Islam or leadership in Islam that emerges after the death of Prophet Muhammad in the year 632 when the Muslims are faced with uh, a choice or a series of choices about how they want the politics of their community to work out. Prophet Muhammad had said he was the last of the prophets. There couldn't be a new prophet. They had to find a new model of leadership. They didn't want to look back to the old models of kingship and empire and so on that were associated with, with the uh, civilizations that they were, the Byzantine and, and old Persian civilization. They wanted something new and the word, uh, the idea of the caliphate slowly emerges. Caliph comes from the Arabic word khalifa, which means either a successor as in successor to the Prophet Muhammad, or it means deputy, as in deputy of God on earth. And so the uh, idea, the, the word carries two quite different meanings. One of them is uh, the, the deputy of God on earth is a very exalted title. It implies a quasi-divine status and so on. The word uh, successor to the, the uh, Prophet of God means carrying on Muhammad's uh, role as an administrator, as a military leader, but not, of course, as a prophet, because nobody else can do that. And these two ideas emerge very early on, or compete with each other very early on. And with them goes another right, conflict of ideas, and that is who should choose the caliph. And one idea is that the caliph should be chosen by the Muslim community. Quite how this was going to be done was not clear. Clearly it wasn't going to be an election in, 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 in the modern sense of the word, but it was going to be a choice by the leading members of the Muslim community. And that is the viewpoint that uh, develops into the Sunni idea of, of Sunni Muslim idea of, uh, of the caliphate. But there's another idea that starts off very early on, and that is that the caliph, the ruler, should be chosen from the family of the Prophet Muhammad. Uh, that is from uh, Muhammad's daughter, Fatima, uh, and her husband Ali and their descendants, and that this family has a particular status because God has chosen them. God has chosen this family, and so they have not exactly, well, perhaps, yes, a semi-divine status, or at least uh, lots of their adherents felt they had a semi-divine status. And they had the knowledge, because God had chosen them, they had the knowledge to solve all those difficult problems which Muslims were confronted with about how you should behave, how you should live a proper religious life, what is Sharia, uh, Sharia law, how do, and what attitude should you take about these things, how should you understand Quran indeed. So these two ideas of caliphate emerge very early on. The caliph as chief administrator on the one hand, and the caliph as semi-divine religious leader and administrator uh, on the other hand. And Muslims throughout the periods of the caliphate have struggled in a way to reconcile these two or to work out which way they work out how they wanted to understand caliphate in, in, in different uh, periods.